Greetings moviegoers, I'm the host, and welcome to another Midnight Movie Madness. We just got back from seeing X-Men First Class. And I gotta say, this is the most impressive one I've seen out of the entire series thus far. The first X-Men movie that came out pretty much got the ball rolling with these X-Men characters that everyone knows and loves from the comics and the TV show. The second one that came out in 2003, I consider one of the best sequels, period. The third one was okay, no, just not great. X-Men Origins Wolverine that just recently came out was horrible, horrible. It was just flat out bad. And you would have thought that a movie specifically about Wolverine, one of the coolest characters in the X-Men franchise would have been awesome, but it turned out to be just as bad as Spider-Man 3. If you liked it, you're a freaking moron. Anyways, this movie is set in the 1960s during the Cuban Missile Crisis and Magneto and Charles Xavier first meet. This is like an origin story for both these men and how they formed this brotherhood between them and the school of which they teach these young mutants. And nuclear war is about to happen and Kevin Bacon is kind of the cause of all this. And they decide to band together and put an end to this genocide. Listen to me very carefully, my friend. Killing will not bring you peace. Peace was never an option. I really enjoyed this movie. This is a very, very good movie. Definitely one you guys see this summer. The acting is probably the best thing about it, especially from the two lead actors, from James McAvoy as Charles Xavier, Michael Fassbender from Inglorious Bastards as Magneto. I thought he was the best actor in this entire movie. As for Kevin Bacon, he is surprisingly good as the villain. Jennifer Lawrence's Mystique, Nicholas Holt as Beast. There's a lot of surprises in the film and a lot of really cool action scenes. It's not in 3D, so you don't have to worry about that. On the scale of 1 to 10, I will give this movie an 8.5. This close to giving it a 9. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. I'm the host. This has been another Midnight Movie Madness, and I'll see you later.